Alrighty then, good afternoon everybody, uh, Silver Dragon here, coming at you with some more extended Terran conflict. Uh, gonna be starting up something interesting today, hopefully, depending if I have access. Oh, Weak UFO! Unknown object. UFO! UFO! Let's display it on my right monitor. There she is, that darn UFO. Must kill, must kill the UFO. Yeah, no. No, I'm just kidding. Alright, so I'm going to be attempting today to start up one of the plot missions after I send my Marauder where he needs to go. I don't think he's going to be able to trade anymore here right now. Alright. What do you have for energy cells? Hopefully that's enough. Navigation, jump to sector, and fly to station. Go to the Federal Argon Dock, or shipyard, I should say. Granted. So that's where he, that uh, Marauder is going to meet up with the other Marauder. And he's basically going to trade the Fragmentation Bomb Launchers. Now, in order to start up this mission, we need certain sectors to be unlocked. It looks like they're actually not yet. I can try checking it just to make sure, but I'm pretty Again, sure this gate's not unlocked yet, which is a shame. 10%. 20, 30, so that's really all we're lacking right now is enough time going by to unlock these systems to be able to use these plots. We got a combat mission here. Eight. Let me contact Not the local installed. board here if I can. Galactic News Service arrives at Aldrin. Solaris ship production industry dies. Solaris system has been noted how grossly inefficient and inflexible their economy is in recent uh, Tazuras. We can see that the only possible outcome in their dire situation has now arrived. Uh, like to uh, completely on the government subsidies and a highly regulated uh, predetermined supply capacity. All Aldrin ships manufacturing has been gone belly up and a complete... Uh, Cessation within the whole industry has been officially declared. Aldrin vessels are completely unsuitable for advanced jump gate and orbital accelerator based space transit technologies. Their ship production quality is way below any recognizable level of acceptability, plus, they are exceptionally expensive and resource intensive to produce in large quantities. Haha, <laughs> poor Aldrins, poor Aldrins. Pirate Pleasure Place raided. Studies suggest soldier husks are harmful to brain cells. Collecting junk now requires a, a license. Lol. Emergency rescue mission initiated. Split travel promises challenges. Alright, that's enough of that. Turbo engaged. I'm pretty sure it's gonna spit me right back out here though. Unless it says it now goes to the new sectors, then it's it's not. Pretty much. Turbo engaged. Attention. Energy low. But yeah, as I said before, the one major downside of the series. At least uh Oh, let me get them through here. Mahi Ma's mistake. I thought so. Figured as much. Alright, I guess I'll go check out that Crystal Fab, see if it's a worthy mission to take. Uh, but yeah, the major flaw of the series is that it's an amazing sandbox, but it's a little bit too much of a sandbox in that sense. Uh, there's no real end goal to the game itself. You have to kind of make that up yourself in that regard, you know. Initially, there was no way you could, like, say, capture a sector. That was something that had to be modded in afterwards, so you couldn't really rule the universe, as it were. You could have a lot of stations, Attention. a lot of complexes, Energy a lot of ships, but then what are you going to do with those stations, complexes, and ships? It's, it, you know, if you don't got any major enemies to fight, you know, no wars to get involved in, nothing like that, then what was the point? So Attention. that was the uh, one downside of the thing, which was some uh, sort of taken care of by some of the plots that were inputted in this. 
But of course, uh, with Extended, its only real weakness is that it has so few plots. It is essentially a complete sandbox in that it's, you know, a complete new area. It opens up over time. It's all for you to explore in that sense. You are talking? How am I what do you got for me? Sure. Incoming message. Oh shit, is there a solar power plant in here? Completely forgot I was out of fuel. Oh, there is, right in front of me. Solar power plant. M Alpha. Lovely. I need some solar cells. Alright. But anyway, as I was saying, although extended uh Although Extended does take care of this a little bit in that the Xenon, and I believe, can the Ka actually invade as well? No, I think it's just the Xenon. I don't know, I'd have to check that to make sure. Basically, some of the enemies can invade and take over sectors. So you do need to kind of fight them back as it were, so that is a good reason to enforce, reinforce and such. But there's so little of that, you know? And so many of the games, like you even the newest one, the of course, which has a million and one issues, Talking Rebirth. Crazy. It's it has no personality to it. It just seems so blah in that sense. You know, the sandbox there is just lame, honestly. Docked. Queen Atreus and the Kingdom of Boron bid you a peaceful. It's no fun to really to do much in it, you know. Established. There is some interest in trading, that's true, you know, I've, at least according to one guy I've talked to, apparently there is some real good depth to the trading, if you get a good 50, 100 hours into the game, but, you know, it's a little ridiculous in that sense. Okay, let's meet up. I gotta go over there. Alright, let's speed this up here. Attention, energy low. But yeah, there's no personality to it. Like, you end up having to, you know, search for all this junk in space and junk on the stations and then take it to these vendors that just happen to be sitting on the station waiting to, you know, take your, buy your junk. You know, there's no real... Attention. Energy low. Oh, what's the word I'm looking for here? Trying to describe this thing. You are positive, please, Doc. As soon as you get green position lights. Oh, it's just so hard in that sense. There's just no Attention. life to it. It Energy just seems low. so... So blah, so bland in that sense. You know, it's... I always had wished that they would make it so that you were... You know, each of these stations were held by certain corporations. You know, of course, obviously the Plutarch Mining Corp owned like 99.9% .9 of stuff, but obviously there's got to be some competition out there of some form. At least I would have hoped so. It seemed like there wasn't much, though. They kind of killed off everyone else. Successfully docked. Queen Atreus and the Kingdom of... You are positive. Please dock. As oh, shit. Granted. I missed a part. Communicate. Queen Atreus and connection with receiving upgrade information. All right, Mandy's a prime. Let's try the Westgate. Jump device charging at. But yeah, I'd always wish that you know 20, each of the stations 30, were owned by certain factions, 40, and obviously 50%, when you're trading with those factions, 60, you would start off in the lowest 70, tier. You'd just be talking 80, to the secretaries. You'd be 90, talking to the the agents. Jumping. You know, you'd be getting missions from the lowest tier of that faction in that sense but eventually you could work your way up you know get a rapport with that faction uh, going Brian. and end up you know eventually Jumping getting missions and maybe increasing. making agreements with the actual Brian. leaders of the faction Miranda Prime Pirate Disco Pirate Buzzard Hauler That should hit him in a second. 
and so on and so forth. I would have added a lot more of the depth to the economy that they were looking for in that sense. Not just the economy, but in the actual missions themselves. Because missions were few and far between that you could actually locate them, and they were mostly kind of lame. They were all the same. Uh, of course, there were issues with the actual AI in which you would end up having to, you know, you accidentally shoot the station like three times and suddenly you're at war with the faction that owned the station. It was ridiculous like that. It's like, dude, you hired me to defend your station. I understand that, but I, shots are going to happen, you know? Shots are going to miss a little bit and may impact your station. Unless I, like, start opening fire completely and attempting to destroy your station. Shouldn't have such a bloody fit about it. Oh, you dicks! In the name of Queen Stole my cracking kills. I'm gonna kill you all. That's why I freaking hate these little bastards, because they get in my goddamn way. Pirate, discoverer, sentinel. Dragon, dragonfly missile. Shit, Discover. I don't have one in wasp missiles. Freaking even wasted two dragonfly missiles on them. That's just ridiculously expensive in and of itself. Fuckers. You know, the AI just had such problems in Rebirth with actually determining fault in that sense. Like, you know, if I'm being attacked by somebody and I defend myself, it's my fault for retaliating. It's not their fault for attacking me. It's all my fault. And that has something that has always been a part of that series. And it's something that's always pissed me off. Pirate, Harrier, Vanguard. They have never properly handled fault in that sense. For instance. Like, if I'm standing still and your ship rams me, that's not my fault. Harrier, Vanguard. There he is. Pirate discoverer. Come at me, bro. Raider. A lot of the whole, you know, not having goals thing as well was actually dealt with somewhat, at least, Terror, by heavy load, a lot carrier, of the missions, Vanguard. a lot of the story missions we had. Oh, wow, yeah, by all means, this Harrier should not be alive right now. It even has equipment in it. I don't know, I'll take it. Ship computer Nova. So there's Raider. definitely some kind of weird glitch in this system here that's causing them to bail Harrier. when they get no health Vanguard. left. Doc here I think has a no it doesn't. It's the next one over then. Gloria Marandiza. Mar Marandiza. No, I thought there was a Maybe it isn't here. Yeah, there it is. Docking granted. I was just blind. May as well get it over with. We're not gonna pay you if somebody Keep else takes your kill, alpha. even though you did most of the damage. Blah, blah, blah. And again, that was annoying as hell, is that, you know, whether it be for you or for the other guy, this guy has a bounty on his head, you know? Some more people than you are gonna be after that bounty, and, of course, the sector police are going to want to kill them too, but... Whoever's actually dealing the most damage, like if I, if I have an epic battle with a giant, you know, Argon Titan class pirate ship that, you know, takes me like, you know, 10 minutes to kill him, and then some asshole comes in and shoots one missile and finishes him off and gets credit for it, that's, that's complete bullshit. There's no way that that would be acceptable in that sense. You are talking to the anime said I shall send the information to you. No. You are talking. How would you like to have this jump? No, not really. Royal. You are talking to the. What do you require? Uh, I could manage that. Jump device charging. All right. So there's just there's just all those little 20, things that just kind 30, of combine to just be 40, sad, really. Oh, I should probably have 60, checked that. Seventy. Eighty. Ninety. Okay, good. They are in there. I might have to call him in here in a second, so I better get him up. Aspiring hope. Okay. Great. Right.
Fragmentation bomb launcher installed. Okay, Pilot here we go. Hades. Target is now in firing range. You were warned. Pirate ships will hunt you down like vermin. Yeah, 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 you've told me that before, and I'm still kicking your ass. Pirate, Kia, Vanguard. Come on, down you go, Kia. Damn it, so low on energy right now. I really should deal with the bugs first. Pirate, Discoverer. Got him. Pirate. No, I want this one. Elite hauler. Oh, he's good. He's actually decent. Attention, energy low. Okay. Time to call in my reinforcements, I think. Although I'm not sure if I have them equipped properly still. Quickly. Where am I? Alert. Command is set closing. Out, suckers. Target left fire attention. A target is now in firing range. I use this as a shield till my ship comes through. There it is. Marauder. Command Attack all enemies. Second. Get them. Quick, get to the Marauder. Get to the Marauder. He'll protect me. Oh shit, they had another one. Alert. Light missile closing. Pirate. Discoverer. Hauler. Okay. Oh shit. Oh, I nicked him. Oh, and he rammed into his own buddy. and the kingdom of Boron, we thank you for your valuable assistance. As a reward, you get 1,000 credits. There goes my Marauder, kicking ass, taking names. Pirate, Kia, Vanguard, Pirate, Elite, Raider. Let's go assist my pal. There we go, that's slow him down. Shouldn't be able to dodge the shots anymore. Pirate, Kia, Good Sentinel. job, you didn't even get hurt. Didn't even get nicked. Then again, these are pretty weak opponents. I'm really, 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 really afraid, though, of the, uh... Of the missiles. Pirate. 
pirate, buster, hauler. All right. No Got him. Discoverer, vanguard. Good job, buddy. Marauder. I'm proud of you. All right, let me take a look at you. This corvette-sized vessel Okay, has so we've got a bunch of those shields. Okay. If you don't mind, my friend, feel free to dock at the equipment dock Docking here. Granted. Actually, what? First, I'll have you dock at the Docking solar granted. power plant. Mm, missile defense mosquito. Command accepted. Not what I intended to do. Not what I intended to Docking do at all. Granted. I know I can uh, get. I can give this guy some flak or some flak, some uh, anti-missile weapons. But I want to make sure that he gets them, because otherwise, if he gets hit by those missiles, especially if he goes up against a missile frig. He's not going to be living for very long. Chip plant. Alpha. You are talking to the... How am I weird? Seven. I shall send the information to you now. Ooh, a hard one. First things first, I better go turn in this mission. Jump device charging at 10%. 20. 30. Jumping. I could have saved myself five cells by going through that gate, but meh. Miranda Prime. Turbo engaged. Let's get close enough to communicate. Attention. Energy low. Turbo engaged. Attention. Energy low. Turbo engaged. There we go. That should Attention. do it. Energy low. You are talking to the automated interaction system. Make your request. What do you require? Give me a report. All right. To where did it want me to go, though? Liberation of thought. Ooh, it wants me to go there, though, and I really don't want to... Well, to liberation of thought, so hopefully that would mean it wouldn't want... I would hope it would not want to fight in that Jump sector because I don't want to. I don't want to risk my ships in that 20, sector ever. Thirty. Ooh, let's 40, adjust my station parameters here. Get some money off of it. Sixty. Seventy. Eighty. Funds transferred. Jumping. All right, let's go trade with my beast. Aspiring hope. Let's see what we actually dropped around here too. Oh, even a Discoverer Vanguard. Bunch of medium shields. Discoverer Vanguard. Oh, it's in fairly good shape. I'll take it. Free cash is free cash. Discoverer, ship computer control, Nova, Discoverer, Vanguard. Mass scan ships reveal objects. Docking the shipyard with you. All right, let me check out the... Alright, my friend. Energy cells are the unified energy storage used throughout the whole known There we go. With 600 cells, you should be good enough to transport all over the place. Okay. Orders, command, navigation. Not fly to sector. I want you to dock at the Boron Equipment Dock, Dock if you don't mind, good sir. Alright! T. Cannon. Ion Shard. Railgun. Forge. Royal Boron Trading Station. So there's quite a lot left I can do here, so I'll probably see if I can range it. 
If that one is unavailable, what other plots can I unlock right now is the question. Uh, there's no way in hell I'm unlocking that one. I might be able to do Divine Retribution. I need Sectors 1-7. Uh, be primeval seas. Okay, I don't even think those are unlocked yet either. Is it predefined assurances for the other one? All right. Hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, there are two gates in there I haven't detected yet. All right. So let's see. Way down at Primeval Seas. Oh, we have unlocked this sector. So I would just have to unlock the sector down below it in order to get that plot mission. You are talking? Ion Shard Railgun Forge. Alpha. Uh, okay, he's on the way to that. So I'm gonna head over and unlock that sector then. If it's the only one I can actually get done, then so be it. Oh shit, I don't have any energy either, do I? All right, to the solar plant. Solar power plant. L Alpha Turbo engaged. Away we go. Attention, energy low. Turbo engaged. Attention. You are talking positive. Please dock. As talking granted. Also, yeah, I wanted to check that thing's guns and make sure that they're all set up properly. I forgot to do that. Okay, we'll dock up here and get some E-cells. And then I'll check on the thing's guns before I transport away. Or jump away. Successfully docked. Queen Atreus and the Kingdom of Boron bid you a and a connection to local trading. Alright, my friend. Marauder. Advanced weapons. Fragmentation bomb launchers all loaded up, sweet. Six launchers. No missiles yet. Hmm. All right, let's get out of here. Jumped Gotta find the south gate and unlock the next sector, and that will allow me to. Start the divine retribution plot. Sector seventeen. There it is. Sixteen. Turbo engaged. Attention. Energy low. Let's block out those suns, shall we? So hopefully this will actually go to the new sector. Turbo engaged. It doesn't Attention. last forever. Low. I really wish it would last a little longer. One of the things that Rebirth actually did well was the boosters. They worked as a really good uh, system to get you into combat quick or out of combat quick. Turbo Gate. Bingo. Jump device charging at 10%. Doors. Sector 17, 16. Sector 17, 18. So with these two sectors unlocked, oh wow, that's nice. I should now gain access to the divine retribution. Plot line. <coughs> oh my god, excuse me. Woof. Uh, let's see. Docking rights with the Terran and the Gonerm. Yes, I should have that. Decent Paranid rank. I do have that. Alright. So now I just have to wait pretty much until they send me a message about it. I don't think there's really anything in this sector, though. I love the music, though, for this sector. Ooh, got some asteroids in here hiding. Single asteroid. I suppose it's worth scanning. 
asteroid. What we got here? Ice yield. Ah. Not ice though. 67. Oh god, yeah. That'd be worth it. If I had anything here that used ice in nearby, I would definitely say hell yeah. Or water in that regard, I guess. Well, no, I guess it just is ice. Because I don't think ice gets refined by anything. It's just taken as a direct resource. Ah, anyway. But yeah, that's the thing as well. It's just, it, they didn't really breathe a lot of lo actual life into it. So there was like, what was the point of really, you know, much of anything in that if you don't give us a reason to, you know, something to do? Let's see. I guess the closest one would be right here. Jump device charging at 10%. Okay, after he's done with the equipment talk, I'm going to summon Rotter back over here to finish equipping his shields. How many out service, Delta? Alright, um, let's see. My Marauder, trade. What do we have? I can trade with you, my friend. Dragonfly missiles, concussion impulse generators, because I have a bunch of them. <laughs> Fragmentation bomb launchers. I think I only really need six, don't I? I'll keep the other two though, so I can put it on the other ship. Alright, trade. Mass driver. Cells are the unified energy storage. missiles. We can even take the... Well, I almost could take the mobile delicious like so mosquito missiles though. I do want to try getting the mosquito missile defense working, so. Mosquito missile bought. I'm not sure if that's the guess to buy or not. He's already upgraded completely. Docking computer. Oh, he can't even he can't get the triplex scanner. That's a damn shame. All right. Jump to sector. Fly to station. Docking granted. There we go. So I have to set it up on him. But I'll dock Please here dock first to get my energy cells. As as get I'm gonna try going to explore Argon space and unlock another couple zones over there if I can, if they've been opened up yet. Let's trade her up here. Successfully docked. In the name of Priest Emperor Zar, our Priest Duke welcomes all friends. In connection to local trading network mm -hmm. established. Let's see, orders, command console. Hmm. Mosquito missile, weapon systems ready. Mm hmm. Back turrets are on missile defense. Okay. Alright, that should be good. Let's jump on out of here. It's gonna take quite a bit. Jump to jump here. I gotta look for the gate in this sector. 20, 30, 40, 50. Let me scroll up here for a second. Alright. There we go. Jumping. Or not. Whatever works. Oh, 
Alrighty then. Predefined assurance. Turbo engaged. Free Argon trading station. So I have to locate all the gates here. Should be two. If I'm not mistaken. There's a whole slew of other sectors beyond this yet that I haven't even unlocked yet. Nothing I can see. Alright. I'll have to bank it hard to the left in a second if I don't see. Oh, there it is. There she is. Turbo I have no engaged. idea if it's connected up yet, but we'll find out in a moment. Attention. Energy low. Okay, that's that gate. Now I gotta go find the north gate. And let's see if that leads somewhere yet. Uh, west gate predefined assurance. It does not. So this area is still not Turbo connected up yet. Engaged. Which is a Attention. shame. Special weapons production complexes, medium Turbo weapons engaged. complexes, lots of complexes around here. Alright, speeding up. Attention, energy low. Ah, there she is. Now this one's less important, it's the west gate that I need unlocked, so it looks like I won't be doing this plot anytime soon, which is no surprise to me at all. There's still several sectors I'd have to go through here in order to unlock the sector I'm looking for. Let's see, Northern Gate leads back here as well. So all gates lead on back here. None of which have unlocked yet. That is a damn shame. So literally, it's just a waiting game at this point. Connect to the Glassic News Service, see if we got anything new here. Bounty Hunter on trial. Or on the trail of uh, somebody. Repairing service. Sure. For 10%? Screw that noise, I'd rather dock at a station and pay less. Argon freighter shot down in Earth orbit. Technological marvels. The Darius is definitely a marvel. Pirate attack. Uh, Solaris security proves inept. Solaris security proves inept. Terran's plan new vessel. Ooh. Terran's being watched closely for new ship deployments. And severely restricted by the general lack of resources at their shipyards for what they can manufacture. And sell. They are unexpectedly made public. A new Corvette design, still in the early stage of production. It will be an enhanced model from their uh, 3D videos and drawings released. It is Tazura. Looks like uh, it'll be quite an impressive vessel. Corvette will be designed to appeal to those who need more firepower to help keep out uh, keep our the outer sector safe, as well as use in large numbers in Terran patrols within their new sectors while the new vessel is still only in early planning stages not yet named that's uh, a good solid addition to the Terran security forces in these perilous times and that's the thing as well the outer sectors that it mentions in that sense there's never any really you know outer sector in that in that sense of things you know there's you know less populated sectors but you know the outer sectors one would expect those to be like pirate havens you'd expect to have, well, of course, we, are, we do have our pirate sectors, which are specifically, you know, like Tortuga, which is specifically pirate-oriented in that sense. Or the Lost Liberties in the sense. Oh, actually, not Tortuga. That's something completely different. Actually, is it a pirate sector? It might be. Regardless, regardless, there is no real outer fringes. There's not enough of a, pres uh, you know, a present threat in certain sectors. You know, there's no real risk-reward system to those sectors or nothing. Which is kind of sad. It feels like there's a lot of lost opportunity in that sense. Defective cartography chips discovered. Split survival camp uh, raises. Our champ returns unscathed. 
Yada yada yada. Aldrin security chief threatens uh, the Terran military. Ah! The hell are you gonna do? Shipyard control center. I have no licenses yet for ships, so that doesn't matter any. Not in the least. But yeah, there's just no overriding, you know, threat of danger in this game other than when you take on like a really, really hard mission, which would just spawn Photon in enemies. Pulse. You are talking. Spit it. I've got it. Encoding data for transmission now. Patrol miner's aspiration. Eh. No, thank you. It's like when enemies tend to, you know, jump in as a, you know, weak kind of mechanic just to say, well, they're here now. You have enemies to fight. Go do it. Uh, there's no real overriding presence they have in the galaxy. It's like, where did these ships come from? Who's organizing them, you know? So on, so forth. None of that exists in that game, which is a damn shame with all the time they spent on it. But what can you do? What can you do? Woo! Alright, let me check in this thing here. Check on my time. Okay, 41 minutes, and they still haven't contacted me yet. Free Argon Trading St Argon Griffin. I should probably check them. Trade. Oh, we do got a large military regular shield, but I don't really care for that. I suppose I could just buy it for the other guys. Yeah, I could buy it and just transfer it to the other ship. Large do that. military shield. Installed. So yeah, it is going in sequence. It started at the large military barrier, then it went. I think it went. It turned on. Did it start on the hard shield? Either way, it seems to be going in a single direction. So next time, it's either going to be the hard shield or the barrier shield that's going to be created, and then it's going to go with the next one and the next one, and then so on and so forth. So it's not producing one of each. It's only producing one at a time in sequence which means it's going to take an incredibly long time for these to be produced. And again, they are the most powerful shields I can get, so... I guess I shouldn't complain all that much. But yeah, in that way, in that people don't have... And this is the same kind of thing with trading, the same issue I have with trading, that there's no origin point, and... Well, there is an origin point, obviously. But there's no endpoint for where all this stuff is being used up. Obviously, some stations are going to have enough crew, enough people on them, you know, working and living on those stations that it's going to use up some resources such as, you know, argon beef or, you know, burgers, whatever it happens to be, or water for obvious drinking purposes. So, you know, each station's obviously going to have that kind of a demand to it. But with all the production of the stations in the universe, that's not going to be the end you know, the end goal for that. So certain planets would also have to have their supply and demand, you know, or at least at least a demand to them where you would be able to, you know, sell things to a station orbiting a planet, which would specifically be trading to that planet and have a high resource demand for it there. Because, you know, there's a lot of things that are going to be demanded by a planet, I'm sure, and all the people on it. It just never... There's just so many different ways that they could have made the game feel more alive and, you know, genuine in that sense. But they just never really did it. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. What do I have? Nothing for my missions. So, let's jump. Oh, uh, where do I want to go? What do I want to do? I suppose I should go repair myself. Jump device charging. And I couldn't possibly 10%. repair the other ship while I'm at it. 20, the other Marauder. 30 jumping 40. see how many millions it's gonna cost me to repair this guy having my own Serious fleet of marauders time. is definitely gonna be interesting to say at least now how many marauders do I have now I know I have obviously the one that's super outfitted right now bunch of haulers doing their job this guy should sell him eh, he doesn't sell for much Carrier sold I have this one in the Federal Argon Shipyard here right now. My Vulture Super Freighter, which I have in a Talati showroom. I want to repair that one because it's a Super Freighter. Those things are expensive. Okay, you all sell. Discoverer sold. So it looks like I only have the one Marauder now. Must have, the other one must have been destroyed somehow. Oh well. Let's go Federal talk to the station. <laughs> Excuse me. 
But yeah, it just, uh, I actually wonder how the modding community is doing right now for X Rebirth, because I've been, I was so just ridiculously disappointed and saddened by what, what it was that they released that I haven't really gone back and looked at it yet. Now, they have actually done some good. I will, I will give them that. They have tried to add all of the really demanded Attention. features that Enemy people Please have dog. asked of them. So, in that, they have done quite well. But they always do it. They always do like that. I'm just trying to think, is there enough... Is there enough of the game we really desire there that it can be eventually modified to be what we want it to be? God knows it would take, like, hundreds of hours of coding to, you know, try and bring it up to where we'd like it to be, but is it possible, even? With the new engine and everything, I like, what, we, what can we edit, is On the question there. Our president and senator, the Argum Federation, oh, welcomes God, yeah, friends half, aboard. Half price. Connection to local trading network Jeez, established. 34%, you're pretty damn weak, my friend. Bringing you up to 100% would cost me 9 million. 9.7 million. Jeez, that's expensive. That's expensive. She's beautiful, but it's expensive. The depot interests me. No info on it, though. Basically, I'm assuming the depot is just a giant storage area. You'd want to connect that to one of your other stations. I'm sure it's in the manual. I'd have to check it, though. Ice harvesting, TerraCorp, Nvidia mine. I would love to get a Nvidia mine. I could never find some Nvidia. Actually, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. Uh, I pretty much looked up all the plots. I don't think I can find anything else there. Let's see. Uh, no, that's not going to help. At least I don't think it is. No, that wouldn't help. That would not help. Okay. Let me search this. Not on this page. Hmm. Try again. Shit. So I can't search that. Well, hell. Oh, well. Solar power plants, complex construction kits, all this other good stuff. Ammunition production, missile, shield production. I'm guessing I don't have a high enough rank to get these quite yet. Weapon production. At least shield production I do have, so I could produce those shields myself if I wanted to. I wonder how much it would cost. Maybe I should just experiment with that. You know what? I'm going to do that right now. I'm not gonna. I'm probably not gonna keep this, but we're gonna experiment. So let's save. Save over game one. Okay, it's undocked. Let me go find a. Station hauler. Turbo engaged. one in this sector. Argon Casino. Oh, there's a casino here. Do I actually have access Not to the casino? Installed. Let's see. Yep, the casino's here. Overflow. Ooh, production overflow and predefined assurance. I've called a strike and the number of nearby tech factories. So our power plants predefined insurance are getting overstocked and are forced to sell energy units at the absolute minimum price. Yeah, I figured as much. I already knew about that, though. Mm -hmm. Nothing else really new here. Okay, let's get going. We'll try the uh, east gate here. Sirius 2 should have what I'm looking for. And do I see one, though? Yep, there he is. Spot him. He's halfway through. He's halfway here. So we'll check this out and see exactly what it would cost 
for me to begin production of large military shields. Series 2. Argon. Supply. Turbo engaged. I would love to buy my own mammoth at some point here soon. Of course, it costs like 22 million, so it's not cheap. To say the least, it's not cheap. Ugh, shiver. Attention. Energy low. Okay, I need to get within another little bit of him. You are talking? We're receiving you loud and clear. What's your transport need, something? No problem, pilot. We'll you I don't care what you're charging. We're receiving you loud and clear. What do you require? Affirmative. Thank you. Now I'm just going to wait for him to actually get through there. Kahuna. You are talking to... What's glad you might find things a little heavy. Eh, not really. It's not a hard mission. Well, it is technically a hard mission, but I don't see it being that hard. Incoming message. In Gemini? Hello? Gate. I don't think that's somewhere I've actually Turbo visited engaged. yet. I think Sirius 3 does have a factory for me, or a uh, solar power plant. I believe Gemini is in that direction, so I'm going to save myself some time. Jump device charging. And jump there. We'll see what happens. Series 3. Oh no, it's not actually. Huh. I don't have a solar power plant back there, though, so I need to go get some energy. Solar power plant. M. Alpha. Turbo engaged. Turbo it up. I need to Attention. get here, dock energy up, and get low. out quickly. Turbo engaged. Attention. Energy low. You positive. Please dock All right. as soon as you get green position lights. I'd love to. Trade. Someone's ramming the station by accident. Successfully docked. On behalf of our president and senator, the Argum. In a connection to local trading network established. Jump device charging at right, jump. 10%. Miner's aspiration. I knew it. There's actually a self gate here. Which Jump I didn't know about. Charging at 10%. All right. Luckily, I love the missions, but they, also, they show you, oh, hey, there's a gate over here, and now you can warp to it because you now know there's a gate here. Makes things so much easier. Jedi. Interesting. Wheat farm. L. Wheat farm. L. Alpha. Hmm. This might be a good place to put a Kahuna bakery farm complex. Of course, that's only if someone would actually buy the uh, kahunas nearby. Yeah, we have the kahuna bakeries up here like crazy. Cattle ranch. So yeah, if I built a bunch of wheat farms here, it would probably make a decent profit selling to these bakeries. Wheat farm, L Delta, turbo engaged. Yeah, we'll get there. Attention, energy low. By the time I finish this mission, we should be ready to Wheat intercept farm that X. enemy. Wheat farm L Delta. Ooh, there's even another gate that's going south here. You are positive. Please dock as soon as you I'd get love to. green position lights. Yes, less talking, more docking. Oh yeah, no, not really. All right, um, hurry up. Beautiful. And actually, that's another thing that they did right with uh, with Success Rebirth was the don't. stations were, On you know, were beautiful. Some Senator. of the things Connection. you could do there were, or well, not that you could do at the stations, but you know, some of the, just looking at the stations and watching them work and having them actually built and designed to be functional in that sense.
Jump device charging at 10%. 20. 30. And away we go. Like actually watching the ore come in from its dock to get melted down and everything else. Was Force acquisition. Jump device charging. Really, 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 really cool. percent Forceful acquisition. Turbo engaged. Attention. Energy low. Turbo engaged. Attention. Energy low. Turbo engaged. Attention. Energy low. Damn it. Target is now in firing range. Dragonfly missile removed. Come on, baby! On behalf of our president and senator, the Argon Federation, thank you for incoming message. Uh huh. Damn straight. I need to start stalking some wasp missiles, though. All right, I don't care for these guys. Let's go finish up what I my job here. We got a station to go test out. After I take out this guy, maybe. Got him. Goodbye. Alright, I've had enough with you guys, so I'm gonna go bounce out now. Is now in firing range. Jump device charging at 10%. Eh, I've lost interest in those weak pirates. Serious Prime. Are you are talking to the We're receiving you loud and clear. What do you require? Affirmative. So basically I'm gonna have him drop it here. I'm going to See if I can purchase those, and if I can, what it's going to take to stock it. All this I've just taken a look at to see how it is. Arena. Oh, that's your arena. You know, let's let's do some gambling. Let's do some gambling, shall we? While we're waiting. To the casino. Parented punch. I bet on fourteen. I bet a hundred thousand. Fourteen. Come on, wheel of shame. Oh, twenty-seven. Try again. Fourteen. 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 Oh, twenty-nine. Try again. I'm only gonna do it one more time after this, though. Come on, 14. Lucky number 14. Oh, 19. And last shot. 22. Oh, well. That was a damn shame. Lucky number 14 wasn't our lucky number today. Okay, let's do this. Federal Argon Shipyard. Added ships. Just trade, I guess. I can buy a trading station. 
but no. Um, let's see. I may as well buy the best one. Shield be. production plant XL. Requires energy still energy cells. Energy cells, Jesus. Energy cells, meat steaks, and ore. Acceptable. In which case I would have it I would actually drop it. If I was gonna drop this, I was gonna I would drop it uh Shield Product I would drop it in Miner's Aspiration. With a couple of wheat farms to go with it for the other thing here. For the Kuhuda bakeries. Just so I could uh, get it all going there. Ooh, XLs. So that's why. Oh, those are cattle ranches, though. Kahuna bakeries are huge. Yeah. Mm, yeah, I totally would drop it in there. But we're just doing this as a practice today, so. You are talking? Lighted ships. You are talking to the other. We're receiving you loud and clear. What do you require? Argon. You are talking. To We're receiving you loud and clear. What do you require? Okay, let's just drop it in the corner here. It's okay to start unloading your freight now. It was a pleasure. Mm-hmm. I'm sure it was a pleasure. I just want to see what the costs are to actually make getting this thing running too, because if it's not that, it's only a three million dollar station. I mean, if it's if it can produce the large military shields, it's worth it. Okay, uh, this shield production complex is the latest development in factory design. One configurable production line for shield production. For actual production, the factory needs the correct shield data, which can be bought from any race if you have a good enough standing with them. Okay, production configuration free. Tiny shields, you can see all the various shields here. Huge flux shields, barrier shields, but there's not the ones that I'm looking for. So you cannot seem to buy military shields. Frack, that's some bullshit. Shield. Product shield. Production complex. XL Alpha. Okay. Configure products. So you cannot... Damn. Damn, damn, damn. So it's pointless. I can make the shields, but they're not worth it if I can't get the military versions. So it's a worthless station to me. I figured as much. I had figured as much. I'd hoped it wouldn't be, but, you know. It is what it is. It is what it is. Okay, so I guess in that case, I will go for backup plan beta in that sense. Let me go get an advanced satellite if we can. High energy plasma throw X X advanced. This station manufactures advanced really? satellites. In addition to the regular navigation relay. I don't suppose you have any for sale. Argon equipment. Argon space equipment docks are the locations in mm. Argon territory for upgrading space vehicles. Yes, I know it is. You don't have nothing. Free Argon. A typical oh, yeah. Argon space station used throughout Argon Federation territory. Developed by Argon over many years, these space stations are useless beyond compare. Mm. Mercury Super Mercury Freighter. Mercury is the latest edition. Mercury is the latest addition to the Argon Merchant Fleet, and it is ship ordered at. Energy cell. Mm. 
Rudder optimization. In rudder optimization. Install cargo bay extension. Installed. Duplex docking computer. In Jump drive. Installed. Navigation command. Installed. Singularity engine. Special command software. And Trading system extension. Installed. Okay. Docking granted. I'm going to leave this one. I'm going to go get it equipped with the uh, next trading software. And I'm going to start setting him up as a sector trader around here. I'm actually going to, I think I might start setting up a whole lot of sector traders and then universe traders here soon. Jump device charging at 10%. 20, 30, jumping. Alright, so it's a damn shame I can only make the regular ones. If I could actually make decent ones, the military shields, if I did have access to those, I would totally have done so. I wouldn't care, I wouldn't care if they'd cost me like 10 million a My pop to buy them, or to buy the plans, or 20 million or something. I would have, I would have bought them. Okay. Kahuna bakeries are huge orbit fact. Kahuna bakeries are Kahuna bakeries are huge orbit factories. So I'd benefit more from actually getting more trade ships here than I would from just getting the thing done. Okay, got it. Let's see here. Yeah, hundred one million. Alright. Navigation dock. Military outpost. Does the military outpost have what I need? No, you can go over here. Docking ground. You can go the and that's a Talati space equipment dock as well, so it'll have everything you need. As long as he doesn't get himself killed for some stupid reason, should be fine. I'm assuming, yep, still locked in. Still locked in. Shit. So nothing else is really worth doing right now in that regard, I guess. Oi, caramba. Let's see, I'm at 23 million still right now. For the moment. Basically, the only reason I bought that, uh, well, part of the reason why I bought that Mercury was to start, start setting it up for a Universe Trader. But the other reason was I just am sick and tired of that advanced satellite factory being out of energy cells. So I'm going to equip it myself. Mercury is the latest. Orders, command, trade. Command accepted. Alright. If any of task is completed, yes. The Boron Dolphin is a cost You have not been set up yet. Quantum tubes are still good. Quantum tubes. Alright. So he's got to stay there and keep filling up the factory so I won't be able to equip him anytime soon, which is a shame in that regard. What else Fire do I have? First. Those guys are owned by that. 
This one's buying energy cells. Mercury is the latest addition to the arc. Oh, that's him. Mercury is the latest. Oh, I see. He's in Dawn of Eons, selling his bow gas. Of course, he barely has any. I wonder how production is on this well. A complex hub controls power distribution. It's going quite a bit right now. Central 950. Command. Okay. Docking at the solar power plant, yes. Notify me when your order is completed. My Marauder. There's my hired ship, of course. I have to decide if I really want to buy some stations or not. Inform me when your job is done. Wait, what sector am I in right now? Oh, I didn't mean to be in the sector. Jump device I'll have to take a look and see if there's actually anything I really want in this. Or what to place down, that is. Serious Prime. Let's take a look at this sector here. What do we have here? That's demanded right now. This station manufactures advanced silicon. X X L shield. Or high energy plasma. Or P cannon. Medium shield. It seems like ore is the one in demand here. Do we have an ore mine here? We do not. Asteroid. Have I scanned all the asteroids here? Excuse me. Let's see. I'm not sure if I have or not. I have scanned most of them. Yes. Okay, there's a couple that I have not scanned yet. Do we have any that have any interesting yields to them? Overall, no. Asteroid. Overall, no. But we'll take a look at the rest here and see what we got. More yield of 21. Alright. What do you got for me, my friend? Asteroid. Or yield of 24. We have a discoverer over there that I haven't captured yet. I should do that. Asteroid. Literally, this is the last asteroid I haven't scanned yet. And there's nothing here at all that is has a interesting yield to it, it seems, then. 22, 22, 28. 23 is the highest yield. Maybe I could build a small one if I really wanted to. Anyway, let's go capture that discoverer then. Discoverer. Oh god, that thing is so beat up. It's not even worth bothering with. Not even worth bothering going all the way over there for. Federal Argon Shipyard. Alright, what do I got for you, my friend? Uh, Depot... The ore mine, even the small one, would cost me almost a million. Meh. Ore mines are mainly built around small asteroids because of the higher productivity that the low gravity of asteroids. Cycle time around. on a 26 yield asteroid. rock would be 1.9 minutes. Meh. Davidium mine, solar power plants, water purification plant. Which I believe it does take ice and make water it Water in the form of ice is harvested from asteroids yep. and then treated by... We don't have anyone that needs water, though. Pretty sure this doesn't take water. It would make sense if it did, but it doesn't. This secret factory is a distillery that produces argon whiskey. Better known to all pilots as space fuel. Mm. Do I want to make some space fuel though? Factory. I don't know how profitable space fuel would be. Maybe I should practice it out, test it out, and see how it goes. We'll have to see. 
We'll have to see. Anyway, there's not really much else. I believe my time is more than up at this point. Well, a little bit. By a little bit. Ah, uh, well, there's not really much else we can really do at the moment. You are talking to the automated... talk to the captain. I don't really need the captain anymore. Uh, let's see. You are talking. We're receiving you loud and clear. What you? It was a pleasure working. I'm sure it was. I'm sure it was. Okay, let me check on this guy. Make sure he. No, they still haven't popped in a new shield yet. It's gonna take a long, long time for this thing to produce any shields. But yeah, it's it's a damn shame that I went through all that trouble to get the this place up and running, and they still will not. Give me anything good. Or is the incoming message? All right, trade energy cells. Not energy that well. You know what? Yeah, that many. Unified energy storage used throughout the whole known universe. Energy cells. Orders command. That satellite factory. I'm sick and freaking tired of it not having any energy cells. And I'm gonna start sending all these guys around. Uh, probably, yeah, next time I'm gonna start setting up a bunch of sector traders, get them going in their various areas that I want them to be at, get them trading, get me some money, making me some money. And other than that, really, there's not too much else to do but wait until the sectors open up or they start giving me the plot missions. Because I have all the requirements for a lot of them now. I just have to wait for the sectors to open so I can actually uh, get those missions. And I still haven't gotten any of that. If I found any Navidium anywhere, that would be amazing. I'd make a lot of money off that. Um, I don't know if... I, I'm, I'm honestly debating that Space Fuel Distillery. Because I've never much bothered with... I think I've had a Space Fuel Distillery once. And that was it. So I don't know who's going to buy it. If anyone will buy it. If they did, it would make me a lot of money. But... Hmm, that's debatable. Maybe if I checked out the pirate sectors, maybe I could trade with them. Well, no, the pirates hate my guts. I forgot. So, yeah, it might not be a good idea. <laughs> pirates hate my guts, so I don't know if that'll be smart. High energy plasma oh, well. power. We'll have to see what to, we'll have to see what we get up to next time then in that case. Let me save up. Overwrite game one, yes. So yeah, anyway, thanks for watching regardless, guys. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed. Didn't mind my various ranting madness, but... <laughs> uh, I just wish for so much more from this series. It's got so much potential to be just the just defining space game out there. But it needs, needs more love. It needs much more love. <laughs> anyway... Thanks for watching, everybody. Have yourselves a great one, and I'll catch you next time. Uh, we'll have to see what kind of trouble I get up to. We did get our mammoth, or a mammoth. We did get our marauder into battle this time, and he did really well. Uh, it was a bunch of slow ships there, fast ships, though, I mean. And I'm really kind of sketchy on whether or not he's going to survive if he gets in contact with one of the enemy's uh, missile frigs. Because those things just unload all kinds of missile hell, and I don't know if the mosquito missile defense will properly function to save him or not. But anyway, till then, peace out. Thanks for watching. Have yourselves a great one. So dragon out.